So, I don't ever seem to have time anymore to actually write anything in a blog post. I'm just going to take videos of the stuff that I'm doing, just ongoing projects and stuff like that. One of my mentors, Gustav, had a drill press, and it didn't have this track on there. It had a different plate. It wasn't as accessible as this one. Um, so that's the, actually the, the original one right there, without the little track ring notch that goes over here on the side, right there. So I installed one of those, and it was actually the, the post wasn't the right same size as this original one. There's a lot of play and slop in this. So I actually took an eighth inch, a three quarter inch material, tacked it, it was galvanized so it stunk like shit, but I tacked it onto the back of this track piece first, and then I clamped up this entire assembly to this post with this on there, and then welded that all on in a couple different spots and everything. So that's all locked up, so this thing is completely operational. And then this little thing right back here, this is just a little bit of a fix. This is a little pressure spring that actually keeps this motor engaged. And if you see, it swings back and forth. Well, there's a glove shoved in there because the tensioner didn't go far enough anymore. So I took the glove out, got a little piece of angle iron, lots of that of size. Just pop it right in there. So now this motor has all the tension it needs to sit against the drive belt. Which is up inside here, which is part of the drill. That was actually a lot of work. It was quite a bitch. Manifestation PDX. Getting shit done.